I don't know about you, but I am a big fan of a sofa and an even bigger fan of a lobby. This is my friend, uh, Miss Bird, and she is uh, also a big fan of this place. Can you, can you become my friend? Is this how I do it? Wait, why, why are you angry? Yes! Aha! Miss Bird! Wait, get, get on my shoulder. Get on my, get on my shoulder. <laughs> Perfect. Miss Bird the... No! No, get back! I don't know how to handle parrots. Okay, sit here. Sit, sit here. P please. Now, now is when I would like you to get off. Now you're sitting. Oh, Miss Bird! The, the, <laughs> the lover of lobbies. Today, I'm hoping to install what at least is going to be the start of my storage room in my my Pacific base. But before I can do any of that, I want to tackle the fact that I am falling behind on these quests. I want to speedrun them. And the first thing I need to do is I need to craft a vault forge, which is a quite expensive piece. Now, having played before, I know the value of chromatic steel ingots. So luckily I have done some bounties that have given me some of these. And then the other big thing is the netherite, which I actually have. Netherite scrap can be found in ornate chests. So that's where I've got my eight pieces. And if you ever wondered how to make netherite ingots, this is the way. <laughs> Vault Forge and quest complete. Brilliant. This is the block that allows you to craft all the different gear pieces and later trinkets. And the next quest asked me to forge a magnet in the Vault Forge. And luckily we did get the main ingredient, which is magnetite ingot as a reward. So then what we need is just a vault gold piece. And that is one magnet, a beginner graded magnet. It'll probably be scrappy. Yep. And it's not the greatest, but that's okay. That completes that quest. And next up is the artisan station, which is another nether, I think it, and more chromatic steel and an anvil. Aha, Vault Artisan Station. If you've never seen Vault Hunters before, this is a very important table because if I complete this, I get some wild focuses and what I can do is this allows me to re-roll any gear piece with a little bit of plating, these things here, and bronze, so that if I don't like my prefix of reach, I can click this button, spend one of these, and a little bit of these, and now I got velocity instead. And that was actually the next quest, to re-roll a modifier. Perfect! Making great progress. Now I need to make a vault scrapper. Actually, it's called a vault recycler. Another netherite ingot! Do I have more netherite scrap, or am I out? None there, none there. No. No, it's not looking good. Uh-oh. Hmm. Hello? Hello? Oh, you're here! Perfect! Um... <laughs> Oh, I see. I see what you. Wow! Wow! Fancy. <laughs> I am currently uh, building one of my own. Oh, nice! I happen to know that this thing produces. Uh, oh yeah! Oh yeah! Netherite scrap. <laughs> and um, mm -hmm. I might be too short to make my own, so I was hoping Aww. for a little bit of a loan, <laughs> oh, okay. and then yeah, go scrap go. some of my nice. own and pay you back. Is that yeah, okay? Go for it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Yeah, uh, wait, wait. Are you saying that I'm actually ahead of you in the you quest are. right now? You are. Look yeah, I'm speedrunning them. I'm speedrunning them. Now it's scrappy vault gear. Oh, wait. And then wait, it's wait, alchemy wait. table. Ah, yes. Um, I'm on the alchemy table. Oh, well, you're not um, that far ahead then. After no, I craft wait, this. Don't go. Oh, oh, okay. Don't go. Um, uh, have you looked at the recipe for the alchemy table? Can I ask you a favour? Okay. Um, I don't like going to the never. Oh, here Come we go. With me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we can go to the nether together. Well, let, let me craft this thing up and I shall okay. return. One netherite and vault recycler. Great success. And if you've seen any Vault Hunters before or played it, you know that we like to recycle. Because recycling gives you good stuff, like faceted focuses and Vault Scrap. Can I get a Netherite Scrap though? Nope. Um, <laughs> well, I I'll get there eventually. Alchemy table. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that is a, <laughs> that is a pretty hefty recipe. I am ready to go to the Nether. I have a portal. Do you want to come over? Hello! Hello! 
Hello. Hello. I have Hello. I have a portal. I am going to be big brain. Okay. Because I'm going to craft warp plates. That mm. way you don't have to go back alone. Because I, I don't need a warp plate. I have this thing. Put one down right here in my nether area. Unfortunately, the oh. nether is not the greatest. This spawn is not the greatest. Let's see um, if I can remember where I went. We can go down here. Look. Oh. Oh. Oh, I knew that. Gas. Yeah, I know you did. Game! Uh-oh. 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 Uh -oh. No! <laughs> well, that's... That's embarrassing. That's a bit problematic. I'm okay. I'm okay. Where are you? I'm back at the portal. Oh, I okay. am gonna need a little bit of help getting down, but... Uh, um, I can't carry you on my back, unfortunately. Right. You don't want me to get the elytra because you're in the middle of the lava. Oh, am I in the middle of the lava? Well, I'm at the, yeah. sh I'm at the shore. I'm floating at the shore. Look at me. Bless me. <laughs> I don't see- oh yeah, look! That was dedication to killing that ghast. I tell you, I, I got this. Hello, hello there. Uh, yes, I did it! I did it! That was totally, totally the plan. I got two even. Of One for you as well. Oh, really? Yeah, no now problem. Now i find a fortress. Very heroic um, ghast here I collected. Yes, it was, yes. No, not again! Leave Wait, here it is! There's a fortress Where? here! Where? Here! Oh my god, there is! Wait, I've got I've got Woo! Uh -huh. okay. In this absolutely garbage biome. Hey, Hold well on. Well done! I'm gonna place down the warp plate here. Okay. Don't go through it yet, though. Let me put a thingy. Oh, yeah, a thingy. Thingy. We need to get inside this place thing. Spawner over here. Yeah, yeah, and we have a warp plate yeah, so we can here, come back. Here. I see a chest! Ninja! Well done. I got diamonds. Yes! Woo! This is what we needed. Look at us! Look at us! And now, we're back in the rain. Yeah! <laughs> oh, oh, it rains. So cool. It rains all the time on this server. I, know. I had noticed. It's oh, fine. Dear. It's fine. <laughs> it's, it's okay. Fine. It's okay. Luckily, this island is filled with melons, so that is a glistering, and that's my alchemy table! Woohoo! And a pretty big reward as well. I did it! <laughs> now, the alchemy table is a very nice thing. What I can do is I can take my potion and I can add an effect to it. I think I'm gonna go with regen. And I got the eight diamonds and eight gold from the quest, so I can just do this. That means... Oh, it's doing a thing. Nice. That means that now, every time I drink this potion, it also gives me regeneration for the next 20 seconds. Next up, I need to craft a plain burger. And I have a lot of burger parts. Easy. And I get 10 more burgers for that. And then I'm finally at the level 10 quest, which auto-completed because I've already reached level 10 and gives me a seal of the sage. That is very exciting because now... I'm going to start getting the elixir objective and not just monoliths. But I have to apply the seal to a vault crystal. Okay, so I guess it's crystal crafting time then. Let's see what recipe I get. Salmon. Hello there, Mr. Salmon. Fishing done and sugar cane. I can get through my little cheeky farmer setup. Look at that. Growing them quickly by farting on them. Brilliant. That means that I can complete the next quest of adding my sage seal to the crystal and i can do the next quest as well actually because it's just acquiring a regret orb and i definitely have yeah i have those perfect complete acquire a jewel cutting station oh that's a lot of layer more i don't know if i have enough layer more left after my last warp plate craft i do not i have 17 and that's it so that's one extraordinary and i need two so i need 15 more of those so i guess that means that this is as far as i can get right now at this moment with my questing and seeing how i have this crystal i should i should get into a vault stress 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 hello 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 hello, hello. check me out ah. oh, you Done it already? Huh? I'm waiting for stupid copper. 
Oh, wow. Do you need 103? I know, yeah. Oof. I'm in your party. Let me just put this um, up here. Ooh, um, look at how pretty this looks in your base. I am excited to start running elixir vaults, though. Oh, we got a cave yeah, I, vault. I've already done one. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Of course you have. Yeah, level 13, big boy. Yeah, I get it. I get it. Okay. Oh, I well, did one earlier when I was supposed to have monoliths. It was very annoying. Well, me too. I've done lo oh, oh, look. Oh, look. A special room. A little gilded sp Should we go down? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> what, what's happened to your courage? I you... know. I don't know what's going on. This is Very this weird. is this is quite scary. I don't have a chest plate either. I did an X marks room on my own earlier. That's impressive. Yeah. Uh, they're not great elixir value for me. Um. No, they're actually quite one, bad. I'll see. Creeper. Uh. Oh. uh they're not great for me either. <laughs> Don't forget, you have to break spawners in this room. Oh, I'm poisoned. Oh, God. Ah! Okay, all right. Uh, okay, it's fine. It's fine. Silverfish gives a lot of uh, a lot of elixir for me. Nice. Like a lot. Like they are jackpots. Okay. Also, they hurt. And they okay. keep spawning in. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, I'm just okay, okay, okay. I'm stressed. I hear things everywhere. <laughs> I'm almost done with my elixir. <laughs> what? Yeah, the silverfish are are big jackpots for me, and I spawned in I even half the dungeon. Gava. Well, I mean, oh, spiders are also jackpot. I got the luckiest elixir roll ever. Okay, you're gonna be helping me a lot then. Yeah, I'm assist your allies now. <laughs> what? This I'm upstairs. Great. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, this stupid silverfish. Like, I hate them at the best of times. Oh, luckily, I got thorns. Where are you? I, I have no idea where you are. I'm upstairs. Okay. Also, illagers are also jackpot for me. Every single mob has been a jackpot. Oh, that's good. Um, oh my god. Are you bringing them with you? What's going on? No, here? no, they were camping here. They were chilling. We have to hit them for them to die. Yeah, I know. Oh, um, okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, Don't double poison. poison. Double poison. Honestly, though, this is this is not as difficult as I thought. We're doing good. Oh, I've just looked at my um, thing and it's like zooped up and I don't know why. I'm on and. Oh, it's because of you. <laughs> 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 oh, what, what you have to realize is that when running something like this with Stress Monster, she has not heard a single thing that we have said throughout this entire dungeon because she is stressed. <laughs> I'm stressed. <laughs> oh, God. I am not finding my way out, but I'm finding chests that you haven't looted. So that's good. Oh, good. I might complete I yours here. Okay, I accidentally clicked oh. one earlier. I'm fine. Don't worry. Good, good. I'm coming up now. I found my way out. We could technically complete this now. I found another lodestone in the room next to the, next to the start room. Okay. One north. So I'll go on you the north flank. It? Um, no, I would like to see if I could find some Laramar. Yeah, okay. You want to know what the most valuable chest for me is right now, Stress? What? Wooden chests. Because of oh, really? sweets. Because I need the food. <laughs> <laughs> no joke. Uh, oh, it's what no. I value the most right now at the moment. Oh, I got my first mob trap. It's fine. I found a chromatic Brain room. Melts. Chromatic iron room. Oh, cute. I found a diamond room earlier. Oh, actually, is that good? No. Oh, oh, I found... Oh, it was good. I found another. I'm going to run more vaults with you. Why? You're being lucky right now. Well, I keep finding the blacksmith. What? <laughs> yep. I can't believe that. <laughs> oh, my God. Great success. Great success. I actually need... Well, I don't need netherite scrap anymore, I suppose. But... I mean, could find some good gear. I don't have very yeah. good gear. Oi! Tapped me on the buttocks. Tappage of the buttocks? Yeah. <laughs> Tappage of the buttocks. The <laughs> Great news, stress. I am done with the blacksmith. Oh my god! Oh my god! Wait! What happened? Oh! What happened? Look at my health! Are you 
hit me. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I am heal. I'm heal. I am heal. <laughs> I am heal. I know, right? I got stressed. <laughs> oh my god. Luckily, stress. I did take a bounty, which was complete elixir vault. Oh, and nice. it does give me 18 Laramar, which is what I need for the next quest. Ah, oh, perfect. So maybe I'll just be like, ah, it's fine. I didn't find an orum, but I found a lot of other good stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah, make yourself feel better. <laughs> it's, it's, it's <laughs> always look at the bright side of life. Do -do 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 <laughs> All right, never mind. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> I save myself, Joe! <laughs> oh, I knew that was gonna happen, I sensed it! If you ever get the chance to run a vault with this wonderful person of Stress Monster, take it. Because the <laughs> amount of the amount of uh, random occurring uh, worries and shouts <sighs> is impressive. And I'm it's saying that in a good way. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I found a secret though. Uh, do you have any kiwis? Um, yes. Okay. Because I'm going to greet this secret ornate. Right, I'll wait then. Ooh. I've done it. Let me know if you need it. Yeah? Um, wait, um, yeah I've, I've done it, but now i gotta, I got to throw something away. Okay. Oh, my God. Because I'm picking up How a present kiwis? for you. How many? Okay. <laughs> How many kiwis do you want me to take? Uh, just eat one. I should be fine. I've eaten two now. Okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Yeah? You buy it? Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yeah, I'm clicking it. Okay. I completed mine! Woo! GG! We did great! We, we did, did absolutely do great! great. <laughs> 35,000 experience? I looted, what? I looted 162 chests. Well, here I bring present for you. This is why I needed you to eat the kiwi. Oh, thank huh? you! <laughs> Very lovely. I appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> thank you for the vault run. Uh, thank you. i see you later. See you later. I love elixir runs. And yeah, as I say, that that came out really well. And I get the layer mark from there. Oh, and I got another level from that experience. I'm level 14. I think Stress got, yeah, she got to level 15 now. <laughs> she, is, she is up there now. I start with popping the crate. Oh, I got the augment. That's a cave augment. That's really good because that means that I can create another vault with that theme. And that theme is unique in the way that it has the raw chromatic iron room. So if I ever need raw chromatic iron, I can get it in the vault. It's perfect. I also got some rare boots. In fact, I got a lot of stuff. It's time for a few more chests, I think. Extending the monster. 35 vault diamonds in that one run. And two mystery eggs. Hello, Miss Bird. Uh, I bring a cookie jar for our dear lobby guests. Take a look at this, though. This is the result of a blacksmith room and clearing the catacombs below that gilded um, village. Majority of these jewels are actually pretty good. I'm going to save all of them. Can I make an identification stand? I think I can. I just need a couple of pieces of obsidian and I don't need this portal anymore. Lectern and identification stand. So now I can mega identify everything at once. Wow. Oh, I got one epic piece there. Some boots and a rare helmet. Oh no, no, not this transmog. <laughs> It's the worst, the wither skull head. <laughs> I, it does not suit my face. It is a bit of an upgrade though, I would say, because of the trap disarm and extra health. Ah, uh, oh, and these boots are amazing as well. Trap disarm is really good now because of the fact that, well, chests can be trapped after level 10. Ooh, they're also very good, but are they better than these? They have less armor, but they do have item quantity as well as item rarity, so I actually think I prefer them. Time to invest. And this is me now, the, <laughs> with this with this Wither Skull helmet. I should now be able to craft the jewel applicator. Yep, perfect. I'm not actually planning on using it just yet, though, right now. I'm just speed running the quests. And the next one is the black market. And I'm excited about this one. 
And all I need is one soul shard, which I definitely have in my pouch. I got 1,285. There we go. And I gotta plunk this down somewhere right here. Oh, there's a knowledge star for sale, but for 4,000. Okay, that may be a little bit expensive, but I might pick up this. So it's an epic. Okay. Uh, I'll pick up a jewel as well. Wooden affinity and mining speed. Wow, so, some great first purchases. Good sword, good sword. The Tarnished Blade Transmog. Oh, this Transmog is, is sick. It's a mega sword. Oh, I low roll the attack damage and the attack speed. But two chaining and undead damage and stun is... That's actually quite good. But I think, yeah, my, mine, has, mine has a much better base roll. So I think I'll stick with my Scrappy. Now I can complete this. I get four stacks of soul shards for that. And then onto the Soul Diffuser. This is another recycler block. A lot more expensive than the Black Market. As it requires one black chromatic steel. Which is four black opals and eight of these. Soul Campfire and Diffuser. This thing is really important because it will allow me to take any item that has a soul value. For example, Ornate Chains. Put them in here, and that will be diffused into soul dust. And nine of these can be combined into a new soul shard. I definitely need to set up a machine for this as soon as possible. But that means I'm done with that. And the identification stand I've already crafted. So I could just pick this up. Nice. And then, oh, I got a full vault gear set here. Let's identify those using the stand. Oh. Look at that, a little cheeky rare helmet. Is it better than my Wither helmet though? It's got much more armor. And yeah, I mean, it doesn't have trap disarm, but I, it looks a lot better. <laughs> it looks a lot better. I think it's mispositioned. I can't see. <laughs> Ooh, upgraded leggings as well. Yeah, they are way better. And now I've got to the quest of crafting a knowledge star, which I'm not sure if I can do. I don't know if I have the resources for that. I do not. I only have 11 Benutite and I know that I need 16 for a knowledge star. So that means that I'm pretty much up to speed with quests. And that's a good thing because um, this place is becoming more and more of a mess <laughs> with every quest, with every table, with everything I get. The time has come to add a floor to Pacific. I have got a floor and I love my skylight. Now my plan is to install some kind of elevator system behind here which I actually think we had in the original Pacific build. And that is what I have accounted for in the back here. And then the rest of this room is going to be storage. However, that's going to have to wait until next episode. Because I am completely out of recording time for this episode. Because I just received a phone call and I have to, I have to leave. I have to go and help a family member uh, five hours away from my house with some stuff before I can play more video games. <laughs> I am really excited about the progress of Pacific. And I will agree to some of the comments saying that it does look a little bit like a Rubik's Cube. But it won't for long. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be stacking it upwards. Look how cozy and nice it is inside now with this little roof and the skylight. Miss Bird, you're a superstar. Anyway, as I was saying, that's gonna have to do it for today. I better hit the road. But thank you ever so much for watching. I really do hope that you've enjoyed this episode. If you did, please do hit the like button down below. Ooh, this is reset. I'll buy this and this. Coconut shield. Oh, how fitting. Yay. <laughs> As I said, I really do hope that you've enjoyed the episode. If you did, please do hit the like button down below. And if you're brand new, consider subscribing. And I will see you in the next episode.